Hey there. You know, I always hear people say, Oh, there's nothing to do. I'm so bored. And I find that really interesting because it seems to me there's actually a lot you can do. And a lot of fun things. And here's just one thing. Maybe you're just hanging out and you just finished your cup of tea or coffee. You're sitting here and you still got your spoon in your mug. Well, there's a pretty fun game you can play with just these two things. You take the mug, and you take the spoon, and you sit here, and you rotate the spoon, and you try not to hit the mug with the spoon, and you see how long you can go. See, I'm playing with a big mug right now, so it's like I'm on easy mode, so I'm just cruising here. Haven't heard a sound yet. But see, we can make the game harder. We take a skinnier mug, and suddenly, it's more of a challenge. Oh, I already lost. Oh, there it is again. See, it's really hard with this one. Oh, I'm on a roll now. Ah, oh, I lost again. But anyways, a lot of fun to be had there. I'm left-handed, so maybe that's not a good visible demonstration for you. So now I'll do it switch-handed, which is even harder. I'm really not doing good. So now that I'm switch hand, I should play on easy mode. So we'll go back to this mug. There we go. Doing a little better. I gotta work on my speed. Oh, I dung it there. So yeah, a lot of fun to be had there. So just remember, next time you're thinking, oh, there's nothing to do, well, maybe you should check and see if you have a coffee mug and a spoon. And suddenly, you'll be having a lot of fun before you know it. I'm gonna keep practicing.